Well, my name is Eric J. Garcia, and I'm originally from Albuquerque, New Mexico, where, which is where I'm I'm uh, speaking to you from. I'm a visual artist, and I do uh, I work in an assortment uh, uh, of media, uh, mural mural making, installations, printmaking. I'm a political cartoonist. I make sculptures and installations. So I do a variety of stuff, but they all have a common theme of politics and history. Um, the most recent project that I'm I'm working on, or I guess I just finished up a. Um, I just got back from from Ogden, Utah, where I was in residency for two months there, creating a a large scale mural, and uh, and an exhibition uh, that deals with uh, the idea of aliens. So that's what I've been doing for the past two months, and I I just got back. I just got back home. I am interested to know. Um, to what extent um, artists are drawing on their own personal experiences um, or to what extent they look outside themselves for, for inspiration and um, why they find one or the other more fruitful. I don't know. I don't know if I could, I don't know if I can uh, say of which is, which is more truthful than the other. Um, it seems like there there are two different experiences. Is one is is from within personally, and the one is from observing or from learning from 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 others, and and that's the way I I work as well. I think I have personal projects like the one I just gave, which details my own experience in the military. Uh, you know, first hand experience that I'm trying to give you an understanding of of me personally in my own personal history and then the other way I work is is I'm, I'm constantly learning I'm constantly um, um, interacting with others and, and gaining information to make other work um, for example I just recently came from Ogden Utah and I had never been to Ogden Utah and they wanted me to make a community mural um, about uh, the surrounding community, and I, you know, I'm an outsider. So I'm now going into the community, and I need help. So I need help to learn about the history of of the surroundings. Um, and I, I reached out to uh, um, an assortment of of people who who live there to help me understand the uh, an assortment of things: the culture, the the history, the the environment. And um, and I'm intaking, I'm learning, I'm questioning all, all and and then I and then I start creating. Um, so I think there's 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 multiple ways of working uh, along with my political cartoons. My these are when I'm doing political cartoons, I could do the very local history. I could do the very broad international history. Now, am I an expert in? international studies or, or the history of, for example, Iraq or, or, or um, um, even in Mexico, I'm, I'm not an, an expert. So I have to uh, trust the new sources that, I, that I'm learning from. Um, I have to ask questions from maybe people who are on the ground who have actually been there. And then I, and then I make work from that uh, is, 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 one of those modes more truthful or more truer than the other. I don't know, because even telling my own story can be embellished by my own ego. So I, I, I think there's 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 different <laughs> levels maybe of, of truth that are going into all those different ways of making.